Um, I'm off to boot camp. Darren is off today. He's um, he's not feeling great actually. He's been he's been not been feeling great the last few weeks actually. And today I think he's just taking it right out of him. He's literally got no energy. Um, so um, so yes, he's decided to take a day off of rest. So he's at home with Ralph in bed. <laughs> Ralph's watching TV. Darren's trying to sleep. He's literally shattered, and I don't know. I think it's just all caught up with him. Um, he doesn't want it to drag on. So uh, yes, he is at home. So yes, I thought I'd use this opportunity to go to boot camp, um, and then I'm going to go again Sunday. So I'm just going to pay the difference. Um, I can just pay a little bit extra, so that's fine. Um, Plus, I don't think I could go two weeks without doing it, like any form of boot camp, because um, I've already got the Christmas um, period where they're shut anyway. So I've already got that. It's going to be like a couple of weeks. So I just need to make sure that I've, I can try and do some running or something while um, Darren's off. So I haven't had any breakfast this year. I'll have breakfast when I get back. Um, I don't really know what I fancy. Um, have my normal boiled eggs and spinach and ham. <laughs> it's just quick and easy. Um, I can do the eggs while I'm having a shower. Um, I've also got nipped to the post office as well. I think I've got to do that on my way back but I don't even want to know what the queue is going to be like. Um, I tried to do it online but I haven't, we haven't got a printer at the moment so I couldn't print anything. And then um, I tried to do it where you scan it at the post office and then she couldn't scan it and I well, she tried and then it wouldn't print or something and then we wouldn't let her do it again it aborted it so I was like oh I think there's a problem with it so I did wasn't it Darren, Darren did print it off and he forgot to bring it home so I was just like I'll request a refund and buy a new one so at least I know it's it's okay because I'm a bit worried that if they, the post was trying to scan it they think it hasn't been paid or something I don't know um, so yeah I'm just gonna get a form and print that off and request a refund and, which is what I should have just done yesterday at the post office um, and then for lunch today I'm gonna make a green soup um, which is basically all my leftover veggies that need using up so I'll use onion, I've got leek, spinach, a bit of kale, some Brussels sprouts I might chuck in, I've got some of those. Um, what else have I got? I've got courgette, yeah, but I'll probably keep that for dinner tonight. Um, so yeah, I think I might make a green soup because it run down wants to like get some vegetables into him, he says, even though he does eat vegetables and things like that. It, um, just wants to top them up while he's feeling not, you know, feeling great. Um, plus, the, the kids like the green soup. We call it monster slime, so they like it. Um, they don't do many vegetables, but um, they do like a green soup. And then for dinner tonight, I have no idea what to do for dinner tonight. Um, I had some chicken, but I used that last night, so I'll have to see what I've got in the freezer. I really don't know. Um, I don't know, I really don't know what I've got, what I can use. I've got lots of vegetarian stuff, and I think there might be a packet of mints in there, I'm sure I saw some mints, if not some corn mints. Or, I might make a lentil chilli. Yeah, I think I'm going to make a lentil chilli actually, so I can use the courgette and carrot for that, and celery and onion, and then a red split lentils. I have done a recipe on this before, so I will, um, if I remember, I will tag up the recipe on there because it's really nice. If you are vegetarian or you like eating vegetarian food or just want to try it, um, it's really, really good for you. Lentils are really good protein, um, so yes, I'm going to have... I'm going to make a chilli actually, um, in fact I could do that in the slow cooker when I get back or I might just do it in the pan so, and then just leave it 
so that it absorbs the flavours and then I'll just warm it up later because Sydney and that will eat that as well so I'll make the soup so they've got the choice of the soup or the lentil chilli um, for dinner tonight um, although Ralph might have the soup at lunchtime if Darren's having some he's more of a sandwich and ham kind of boy Darren and Ralph that is <laughs> both of them actually are but um, no Darren will have some soup for lunch Oh, also, while I remember, um, I'm going to do a little Q&A, like a Christmas Q&A, but it doesn't have to be Christmas related. It can be, well, it can be Christmas related. It can be Sydney World related. Um, it could be anything related, really. Um, so, yes, I'm going to be doing that um, probably next week. So, if you could leave some questions below. Um that would be great um, or you can send me a DM over on Instagram or if you follow me there um, I will also put a little QA question on my Insta story so if anyone wants to ask me some questions and then I will do a video um, I have done them before but I just thought I'd do some different one you know with the Christmas period coming up so yes leave your questions below um so i'm nearly at boot camp now so i will say goodbye and i'll let you know how i get on so i've just finished boot camp and on my way home and um yeah it was just it was boxing as per usual on a wednesday but it was quite tough today lots and lots of squatting um and lots of other exercises oh it's, that light is very bright sorry about that um that. let's shut my window I don't think that'll make any difference now no it makes no difference <laughs> sorry you got a light shadow over my face yes yeah, so I'm gonna head to the post office now and then I'm gonna go home have a shower um, get ready and then I'm gonna and then I'm gonna do some cooking so breakfast this morning was ham, spinach and two hard boiled eggs with half a sin's worth of sriracha sauce. So I'm going to turn this into a green soup. So I've got, um, I'm going to get another onion actually, I'm going to have two onions, some kale that needs using up, uh, Brussels sprouts, I'm going to throw in some of those, probably half the packet, celery, leek that needs using up and I found this in the fridge <laughs> so I'm going to use this, um, cut off all the monkey bits but yeah. I'm going to make green slime soup. So uh, I'll show you what it looks like once it's done. So I've put everything in here. I've also put in some broccoli stems that I had in the fridge that I saved because I knew I was going to make a soup. Um, and I quite like eating them raw as well. But yeah, I've put everything in there. It's a quite a big pan. Um, so it's going to make quite a lot. Um, I used three stems of, um, three stalks of celery, half the packet of the broccoli, and everything I else I added, apart from the kale, I've added half that pack of kale. But I might add a couple of more leaves. And then I've added one of these stock pots, um, which is Tesco's, which is free. And it's the garlic and thyme stock pots. So I just added one of those. Um, I'll see how it is and I might add another one. But I filled it up with water, so I think that should be plenty, because it will go down. I don't want it too watery. Um, yeah, I'm just going to leave that with the lid on. Um, and leave that to cook and I'll show you what it looks like later. So here is my speedy green soup. Um, I'm having it with a light and free yogurt which is one sin. So here is the lentil chilli that I made for tonight's dinner and I'll serve that with some boiled rice and here's all the leftover soup. So um, I'm going to freeze some of this and put some in the fridge for the week. I also made a mincemeat oat bake um, which is four sins for tonight's uh, treat bowl. So it's about half three and I'm just having a packet of French fry crisp, which is four sins. I also had a banana, um, which is free food and also had an easy peeler, which is speed. So here's tonight's dinner. I've got the lentil and chilli, which has got lots of speed in there. There's tomatoes, onions, uh, courgette, celery and carrots. I'm just serving it with some boiled rice. Um, so that's my dinner. 
So I'm ending the day with my oat bakes, which is my healthy extra beef for today. And I used four sins worth of mincemeat. Um, I also serving it with some quark um, for dipping which I sweetened with some skinny syrup and I also had a Sarah's Creative Kitchen Chocolate for three sins. So I'm ending the day on 12 and a half sins. Thank mm -hmm. you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this video and I'll speak to you all very soon. Take care. Bye.